Morning, peeps. Sip Spy is a subscription of tea. The best thing I like about them is that you can choose whether you want caffeinated or non-caffeinated or what you're interested in. That is the best part to me. I do have my cup. This is, has my grandsons on it. I have a ball in case today we're going to use a ball and we're going to open this up. So we've got July teas. And of course, here we go. First thing I see is the little bags that you can put tea in. These are nice to have. I don't usually use them, but they are nice to have. Um, this was the first one on top. Organic Mother's Little Helper. A la Rescance de something or other. And it is a loose tea in there. So we are going to, it's caffeine free, yay. And we're gonna get it started here. It is a loose tea, so we're gonna have to put it in the ball. And then we'll see what we're supposed to do with it. Now I just pour it in the bowl. I don't know how you guys do it, but. Oh. Well, never mind. There was a bag in there. It looked loose, but it is not. <laughs> Ignore me. Okay, let's give it some hot water. Oh, man. Does it have real... Re no, it's not re Ruibos. It's Valerian in it. Okay, so there are four of these packets in here. And let's look it up first, okay? Organic Mother's Little Helper Sips By by David's Tea. It has organic pepper, organic lemongrass, organic hibiscus, organic rose hips, organic chamomile, organic valerian root, cornflower natural peppermint flavoring. See, I do not, I don't like the smell of valerian. I could almost tell you when I smelled it, that's what's in it, valerian root. I don't, I don't find that valerian root does anything for me. So I can't, it's hard to put up with the smell because of that. I don't like the smell of valerian root. Okay, so we're gonna test that in a few minutes. Let's see what else we've got in here. We've got four packets of this one. This one, Wild at Heart, it's called, by Off Black. This is a hibiscus apple, rose hips, blackberry leaves, black currant leaves, flavorings, strawberry, pink pepper and safflower. What is pink pepper? Interesting. Strawberry and pink pepper is what it's called. That's interesting. Uh, they are, uh, there's four packets of this. They are unindating with turmeric. I, I know turmeric is supposed to be good for you, but it's just not my favorite. This is turmeric active by Puka. Turmeric root, ginger root, gal galangal root, licorice root, nettle leaf, celery seed, burdock root, orange essential oil, trifala fruits, amla something. Everything's organic, it says. But it's turmeric. I don't, I don't like turmeric at all. And then there's one packet of loose in here. This is Vanilla Bliss. It's by Tea Kitten. It's Ruibos Natural and Natural Vanilla Flavor, and that's it. 
These are all caffeine free because I do ask for caffeine free in case you wanted to know. So I like that about this subscription. I'm just going to put that out there. I have started another one and I probably won't keep it because of that. I don't tend to drink unless I have a headache. I stay away from caffeine. So anyways, and I like this. Made for Jean. They know me. <sighs> okay, this is last month's, okay? So we are going to look at it. Sipping Stream, Northern Serenity. Um, oh, snap. <laughs> this one, it says you can re reuse the bag four times. I've never found that they're strong enough for me after that, but you can. Um, I did like this even without sweetener, so a thumbs up on this puppy. Northern Serenity. The next one in the pile is um, Turmeric Elixir. Um, this was that weird powder stuff, and I put it in almond milk. Didn't help. I put it in hot water. Didn't help. Nothing helped. I did not care for it. And it's probably just me because I dislike turmeric. So I, that was a weird powder. I didn't, not a fan, not a fan. This is Beauty and Brain. This one, uh, it was okay. I could drink it either way, but it didn't have anything that jumped out at me and said, keep me by me, whatever. Last one. Now this one, oh. I think this is my favorite tea I've gotten so far. This one is the French Roast by Ticino. This stuff was absolutely amazing. If you have given up coffee, but you love the taste of it, oh honey, I recommend this good. You can drink this, if you like black coffee, you can drink it black. If you like it with cream and sugar, I mean this, this stuff, ooh, yes. Anyways, um, I was talking to Jennifer and she was telling me that they have a whole bunch of them at the health food store. So, so she brought me a box, so I've been drinking this. So Jennifer brought me a whole entire box. Awesome stuff, I recommend that one. This was one she recommended, it's hazelnut, same sort of genre. It was good, but I like the French roast better. Just personal preference, but it was very good. And she also said they had mushroom teas. And she bought some and gave me a couple to try. So check this. If you're looking for a good tea that is reminiscent of coffee. Oh, girl, go and find this one because it's awesome. They have some really great. There's different flavors and stuff over there. But I love this French roast. I... This will be in my stash. It's, I have always loved the Twinnings Lemon and Ginger. That's my favorite tea. And this one's gonna be pressing for first place. Awesome stuff. Yes. Okay, Mother's Little Helper. We're gonna test it out. Again, I can smell the valerian root. I do not care for that smell and it hampers my taste buds, I think. You can taste the mint a lot. If you like mint tea, you'll probably like it if you can get past the smell. Mint tends to make me want to put sweetener in it. And I'm not sure why, because it's not really bitter, but it's really not my my idea of a good time. So I'm, I know I'm not going to like this one simply because I have issues getting it up to my nose. And somehow, if it doesn't smell good, it doesn't go in my mouth. So I'm not gonna be a fan, I can tell you that already. And it's gonna need sweetener because of the peppermint in it, or mint, whatever it is. I've forgotten already, what is it? Um, natural peppermint flavoring, yeah. I do like peppermint sometimes, just not mostly. So anyways, that was it. My Sip Spy subscription information in the description if you're interested. I do like it for the most part because they give you options. You have lots of options. 
So there you have it. I hope this finds you absolutely flamazing. Stay blessed. Until next time. Hey, you made it to the end. Please hit like and subscribe and thanks for watching.